You know, I've noticed that there's been some effort put into uh, screen mounts for uh, home living room setups for your TV and for your office for bigger, you know, work-related monitors. And it got me thinking, why can't we bring the 40x experience of the theater into people's own homes? And all you need to do this to really enhance your experience, we already know that there's you know, 4K and 8K screens that do 3D in various ways that have come out over the last decade or two that are flat panel and convenient. So if you had a piston mount set up for your screen, then the screen could move around slightly based on the action. And then you say, okay, well, how is that so cool? That's just kind of annoying. But if you pair that with a 3D experience where you have a four-person couch just like at the theater because it's four-person seating for the moving because it's too much weight otherwise for the moving seats well there needs to be a home version a four-person seater so you know you can have a family sitting there watching it at home and get all the effects of a theater because what i'm saying is this stuff I'm proposing that seems to be they're getting under uh, filming and slide bits and pieces I see already uh, for the continuation of the uh, Marvel verse. It needs to be accessible to people who are still in Corona lockdown in parts of the multiverse that are sick still. They can't go to theaters. Sometimes there's violent freaks around, so they can't leave their home very often. It's bad. So, we need to bring the 40X experience into people's homes, the smell o vision box. I mean, I'm going so far that I would say you could have the box that has the smells, the same as the theater, that jets out, you know, at people's feet or wherever in the room with fans into your living room. So then, um, I'm so nuts because, uh, I'm still waiting for the 5DX experience where the screen X is included with the projectors on the side walls of a theater room. And I'm like, so forward thinking, of course, this wouldn't be first generation or anything, but this concept of uh, projectors out of the same smell o vision box you set up at the center of your room, of your living room, then it projects the side uh, screen X data out you know with little projectors from either side so then it's like you're getting a projector box with your whole setup that you could use for other stuff too technically but especially set up for the 40x experience at home and this whole kit needs to cost nothing you know it's the future come on it's just pistons and it's already been all set up for theaters it's an easy way to make more moolah you know, again, off of people, supposedly, because they want to watch it in theaters anyways. They want that experience. So the 40X experience at home, you could have it live with the theater release sometimes for some content, and if people want to wait a day or a week or a month or whatever for some of the content they produced to be available on 40X at home experience. But... It's the future. We got to start thinking like everything's live or is it Memorex type, you know, sensation. Here's my thoughts. And I just wanted to cover something really quickly that I know a lot of people are really weak when it comes to the sides of their ability of their eyes to pick up high frame rate as much as in the middle of their eyes. This can be scientifically noted in yeah. by eye doctors. And that's no reason to um, fuck over other audiences who can't see on the sides of their eyes by trying to damage the projectors in some way. Yeah, that's what everyone's been doing. Um, so instead, what I advise is that they get over themselves and for their houses and for their versions of movies, they design movies with roiling effects on the sides of screens with lots yeah. of gases of, you know, different types that are found in QLED screens, you know, the more neon colors. And then on the sides, on either side, they have mounted light projection bars in the yeah. front corners of the screen. So on the side walls, they get color emotional impressions of the scene through the gases. Yes. 
that match the scene. Yes, that are just and, a conglomerate of the light of a screen axe experience anyways, yeah. usually. So then you're at least projecting the light anyways. Yeah, exactly. We gotta, you know, move on to this jealousy. And then you can do that in your home release and get some mood. Wow, a sonar attack. Yes, wonderful. Thank you, airplane, the 20th of the morning. <coughs> Let's see here. Um, <coughs> yeah, I can't think now, so I'll just 